being gone but as you know I have my main channel which is my Spanish channel but I really wanted to uh, record this video in English uh, because I really wanted to show you this DIY which I, is the first one that I have from many many that I have for, for you this um, holiday season and this is so so cheap so pretty and so so easy to make and I wanted to stand uh, over here just so you guys could see more or less the size of this um, DIY it's so so beautiful I really really loved it everyone that has seen this have said that they loved it and they want to make their own so I really think you will enjoy this uh, a specific project and I would really like you to invite you to my Spanish channel because from December 12th to December 24th I'm going to have uh, one video daily uh, with DIYs and makeup and you know kind of a small vlog mess but uh, just for those 12 days so um, it's going to be a lot of work for me if I will try to do this uh, in voiceover in English and Spanish because that will be 24 videos in 12 days so it's a lot but I will make sure that I have uh, English subtitles for you guys so I would really like to ask you to go and subscribe to my Spanish channel because you can see uh, the English subtitles with everything that I'm going to have for you in this holiday season so without any further ado let's get started with this project so for this project we are going to need a styrofoam ring and as you can see I covered it in tape so it will be stronger. If you can find a wood or plastic ring it will be even better, I just couldn't find any. Over here I'm just showing you how it was uh, from styrofoam and I just covered it, this is just for a smaller project. And after your ring you're going to need scissors, tape, a ruler and some Christmas decorations of the color of your choice. You'll also need some tool, I used 9 meters. I'll leave you the size in inches but obviously you can use less if you want to make a smaller project. You'll also need some silicone either cold or hot. For my project I chose this glitter tool but obviously you can use whatever you want. Just make sure it's stiff enough so it can stay in the wall. So now you're going to take your fabric and with your ruler you're going to cut some strips. I'll leave you all the measures in the information box below. Remember that you can make it as small or big as you want. Now just take your tool from the glitter part in case you have one similar to mine and put the glitter part facing up and then just go like this and fold it exactly in half so the ends are even. Now just take this loop and put it underneath the ring and we are going to put both of the strips in the middle of the loop. Just pull gently and then you have to tie the knot. It's okay if this is a little bit loose, but don't worry, just pull gently each strip so they are even. Just make sure to make them very very tight, just like this. And then you're just going to repeat the same procedure, but just make sure that once you are done, you just have to put all these uh, knots together so you can have a very fluffy red. So just pull them together as you can see here and just keep going with the procedure all around the ring and this is actually very fast so keep adding your strips until you finish your red so don't worry if when you are adding the last strip you have a bigger hole because we're going to cover that with the Christmas decorations so at the end just tie every knot again so you can have them very secure and fluffy and if you want to make the same size as I did I use 33 strips so as you can see I had a little bit of fallout but I just bought more glitter and with a little bit of hairspray or glue spray I just spray it on the tool and add a little more glitter for more sparkle. So then I just got these beautiful amazing flowers in pink and silver and I got this for less than $2. So now I'm just going to cut every leaf so I can have a better handle of it and I'm just going to put them around the wreath so I can have a better idea of how I want the decoration. I recommend you to do the same so you can make changes before you actually glue them so you can be very creative and put any decorations you want and that they match with your Christmas tree. So now I'm going to take my silicone either cold or hot and I'm just going to put a little bit on the tip of the leaf and I'm just going to apply it in the middle to cover all the knots. So now I just decided to put one silver and one pink and this is the result and then I also bought for a very very cheap price these Christmas decorations in silver. I'm just going to take the small flower and these little branches and I'm going to put them in the middle of the leaves 
and I'm just going to glue them together as well. And then I'm just going to add one flower, one leaf and one branch and I'm just going to put it all around the red. And this is the final result. You can also add some Christmas lights and this will give it also a very nice touch. And this is the final result. As you can see, it's lovely. I'm actually so in love with this project. And then I changed the background because I feel like you couldn't really notice how beautiful it is. But trust me, in person it's stunning. Every person in my family has said that they want to make their own and they just love it. So yeah, I really think this is such a fun and cheap project to make and it looks really expensive. Okay guys, so I really wanted to be a little bit closer to you. I just wanted to stand over there uh, so you could see more or less the size of this uh, crown. But yeah, I really hope that you guys like this video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up so I can still uh, make this um, kind of DIYs for you guys. And remember that I'm going to have a lot of videos in my Spanish channel about um, from December 12th to December 24th and I'm going to have a lot of nice videos and as I said I'm going to have English subtitles so just go there and subscribe and yeah thank you so much I'm sorry for being away I'm going to try to uh, incorporate more videos to this channel but yeah just go to my uh, main channel and just so you don't miss especially this holiday season because I'm, I'm really going to have very very nice projects for you guys so yeah that's it for today I really hope that you had a very nice Thanksgiving and I'll see you very very soon as well I'll send you a very very big kiss and I'll see you soon bye La verdad es que las decoraciones que les traigo aquí son súper fáciles de hacer y les van a hacer sentir